Hello my dear viewers, welcome to this reading. This reading is for Aquarians and it's for the month of June onwards 2024. It's all about your money Aquarius, all about your finances, your work, your career, everything you need to know for the month of June and a little bit over. Welcome my dear viewers and let us begin with the first message to see what the heavens, the universe, the source, your guiding angels want you to all know. Okay, so a card did jump out and it's called the fairy magic okay let's have a look at the fairy magic to see what is it about with glasses on fairy magic says that it says respectfully work with the fairies to achieve your goals and this shows that your guiding angels are going to be there supporting you in getting all your goals achieved it also shows a uh, a lot of success is coming your way especially in a new venture where you're collaborating and working team hand in hand with others so it looks like there's going to be a lot of success coming like magic things are going to be booming for you my dear Aquarius let's have a look what else you need to know we have leadership you are going to be taking the lead you might be offered a leadership a high-ranking position managerial position but I also feel like you are going to be leading um, a situation and taking it to the next level, especially a challenging one. But you, it's going to be using your skills, your power of leadership to be able to move you to the next level and to resolve the situation. There could be a problem with it. There could be a challenge, but you will be able to resolve it. One more message for all Aquarians. What happened? Oh, there we go. And this is all about freedom. You are going to have the freedom that you truly um, need and want I saw number 13 twice here 13 uh, if that means anything to you if you've been seeing one one or one three 13 is also about a new beginning and working well together and team and succeeding it's all about success it's also about the Chinese year of the rat Chinese year of the tiger and Chinese year of the rabbit which means luck is coming to you very quickly and freedom at the same time that's beautiful okay two great messages now let's have a look at what else you need to know we're going to take four messages important factors for all aquarians for the month of june onwards money work career it looks like there is a situation where it's reached an impasse you've done all that you can but there isn't much you can do there is no resolution for this situation it looks like that every aspect um, is leading to a dead end so there is a dead end situation that might come to an end you are going to be taking action moving forward you're going somewhere some of you could be traveling some of you could be moving some of you could be taking action in regard to this situation I do see that the nine of pentacles here shows that there could be an earth energy uh, around you or surrounding you or supporting you to reach your goals earth energy are people with either Virgo in them Taurus or um, um, Virgo Taurus Capricorn so supporting you to get to the point to get to where you want to achieving your goals then we have the six of pentacles this person could also be giving you a gift of money I do see a lot of money coming in helping you finally to get what you want done and help those who are in need a lot of money is coming your way what you don't see coming justice will prevail and you will have it all justice on your side and also I feel like it's time for you to rest now. The Wheel of Fortune is going to give you extreme abundance, extreme luck to take you to the next level. So prepare for that. That's what's coming. Now, let's have a look at three more important messages for you, my dear Aquarius, regarding your money, your work, your career. Let's see what else you need to know, the truth. And we have, we have the moon. A lot of truth and a lot of secrets and a lot of revelation is going to be revealed and you're going to find out a lot of things this is going to help you move forward and know where you're heading and what to do it's like as though by this revelation by these truths you're knowing your path and you're knowing where you're going so that's very interesting a lot of uh, finally you'll know where you're going uh, this is all about the devil and the devil is about in it's an area of your life where there is too much, something too much happening. It could be an addiction to something, codependency. It could be just doing something too much or being controlled by others or at the mercy of circumstances. But this situation needs healing and healing is coming. It needs to be healed. Let's have a look at the final one. And then we see here the, um, the Eight of Wands, which shows something very quickly 
you need to take advantage of. If it's news or information comes to you, take advantage of it quickly because you are going to be resolving a major problem and also um, taking advantage of a great opportunity. So that's what's coming in that regard. What you don't see happening and coming, we have the Knight of Swords. Great news to give you the go-ahead to move forward. So you'll be very happy, very happy. And there is something coming to an absolute end. We've got the death card, which shows the end of a chapter or the end of something that wasn't working well. That's coming to an absolute ending. Changing, transforming. Okay, what you don't see coming. Right. Now let's have a look at a few more information. Now I'll just put these down a bit. Let's see if they're showing. No, they're not. I'll just put them like that. That's about all here. Mm -hmm. Now let's have a look at... And I'll do this one. Same with the moon. I'll just put it over here. Three more important messages for all Aquarians. Money, work, career. We've got the first one, which is the gift. A beautiful, beautiful message. I'll just get the others and I'll go through them one by one. For all Aquarians. Okay, there they are. Now, so we've got the book. And we have the cup. Wow. One more wonderful than the other. Okay, let me go through them. Let's go together. Starting with the gift, this is the gift of money. Oh, sorry, it's a sudden windfall. Sudden windfall. So play the lotto, play the lottery. You've got the lucky numbers in the community section of this channel. You just go into the community, so you go to AUL, look for the community section, click on it. There's going to be um, a post there, lucky numbers. Go into it, take the Aquarius numbers. You'll have three batches that have come, that were given to me by um, the, our guardian angels um in meditation and i have written them down three consecutive years they're all there for you take them play them with wisdom very small amounts of money five ten dollars you don't need to play more but play them continuously i do feel that there could be a windfall for you um, i do feel like the universe is going to be very generous with you i do see money coming in big time for you and another thing which is miraculous is this this one here Look at this winning money. The cup is about winning money. That's why I was shocked they both came in the reading. They never come together. So you had a windfall and now we've got winning money. So I do feel like a large amount of money is coming. And I do feel like this is what's going to give you the freedom to spend and do what you need to do. So this is really important. Uh, the gift of money, a windfall. Sorry, not a gift. It's not a gift of money. It's a windfall. And then you've got winning money with everything else that you see there. A life of abundance and extreme luck and money coming your way. Extreme luck. That's why I said play the lotto, play the lottery, play something. But do it you know, every month if you can, every week if you can afford it. Just play very, very small amounts. Okay, so where did this come from? This was here. All right. Okay, so the, yeah, the gift is also about generosity. It's about giving and receiving, being generous, helping those who are in need. Like it shows here, when you have a lot of money, you'll be helping those who are really in need. You'll be supporting others and becoming very generous. Um, it looks like also this is about careers, about in supporting people. Financial support is there for you also. Work, um, surprise, something surprising is happening. And vacation. Some of you are going on a vacation. You're leaving, you're going on a vacation. So that's beautiful. Okay. In regard to the um, to the award, you are going to be awarded big time for all your merit, for all your hard work. There's a merit for you. Paying off for your efforts. Everything you've done, all the sacrifices you made, this is time for you to be paid by the universe, by those around you, by your community. Winning money is another gift from the heavens because as a payoff for all your efforts. Remember that. Recognition, you are going to be recognized also. I see advancement in your life, in your career. I see professional work and I see fame and fortune together in this cup. So that's wonderful. Okay. The book is all about contracts, signing deals, paperwork, putting papers together, signing documents, learning as you go. There's so much information that you're not, you're not familiar with your learning, but you are going to be um, you know, it's as though it's it's as though you're doing something that you've never done before, and it looks like it's going to be educational. Some of you could be thinking about, you know, um, helping others in in writing or working, taking class, learning, teaching. Uh, this could be also about dealing with the government, law, needing a lawyer, perhaps 
Uh, it's very interesting because you are in a place where uh, a lot of uh, paperwork is needed. So you might be either starting a job or doing something very big. Okay, we're going to take two more messages and then I'll clarify the cards. Let's see what else for all Aquarius, June, money, work, career. So we'll take the first one. Right. And one more. Okay. It looks like to me, navigating by the stars, it looks like to me you are traveling. I really feel like you're traveling. Many of you are in the process of traveling because these both are to do with movements. It says keep going and keep going where you're going. Keep going forward and you're doing well. Follow your bliss. So wherever you're going, it's going to be blissful for you. A lot of blessings are coming. Um, that's why I, I feel like maybe you're going to a place where you can be doing charity, perhaps. Navigating by the stars also means, you know, um, following your bliss and following what is destined for you. Some of you are really taking a big trip and you're supporting others on the other side where you're going. I do feel like um, it is destiny taking you there and destiny has got a plan for you. There's a divine plan that you might not even know about, but it's really big and it's major. And, and I think it's all part of this gift that's coming your way and you know, the blessings that are destined for you now my dear Aquarius let me have a look at two messages from the spirits of the animal spirit so we've got beautiful elephant and one more the June money work career and we have the dragonfly wow one more intriguing than the other the dragonfly is all about the truth the truth that transcends illusion. The truth that opens your eyes to the truth. Oh my God, it's the moon. This is about you seeing clearly. This is about you knowing where you stand. This is about you finally understanding certain things that you never understood before. And because of this, you're taking action. Because of this, you're able to see your path clearly. Because of this, you are succeeding. Success is imminent, 100%. Wow. Wow. You are going to over, over, you, you're, you're going to heal a situation without a doubt by seeing things clearly. The dragonfly, how amazing. If you've been seeing dragonflies, well, you know a lot of success is coming by you seeing the truth of what was hidden from you. The elephant spirit is all about spiritual journey. It's about freedom, spiritual freedom, and it's about learning from the past as you go. You're learning, you're expanding. You're changing and there's a lot of freedom. Again, we have freedom. Many of you are, it's like as though you're taking action for your freedom. You're going somewhere and it's in the midst of that going, wherever you're going, you are going to be feeling a sense of freedom that you haven't felt in a long, long time. Freedom with a lot of happiness coming your way. Wow, that's magnificent. Okay, now I'm going to start clarifying the cards so we can understand everything what's going on. We're going to start with the moon. Let's see what the moon is going to do for all Aquarians. What truth that's showing you your path are you going to reveal? What is it going to do for you? Well, it's bringing the sun. How, how amazing. It's bringing the sun to give you healing in all areas of your life, to bring you abundance, to bring you happiness, to bring you a soulmate to bring you um, the dream job that you want and to start a project that's going to bring you wealth. Some new project, some new idea you're putting into action, something's being given to you as a gift or a new project, it's going to bring you abundance. So there's wealth here also. On top of everything, you've got the money, you've got this and you've got that, and you've got the beginning of prosperity and a lot of wealth and a lot of luck and winning a windfall and winning money. So I feel like something really big and major is happening in your life that's changing your life completely and utterly changing this is the greatest change it's giving you freedom maybe freedom not to work so hard freedom to help others to travel to do charities it's you're transcending to high levels my dear Aquarius I don't know this is really big big and major what's happening here so the moon is helping you see the truth and giving you the Sun which is all about abundance and healing healing Someone new in your life, someone wonderful, a new idea, a new concept that's going to be booming. That's what's coming. Let's have a look at the Two of Swords and see what is the situation that's reached an impasse and there's nothing in your hands, nothing you can do. What is that all about? Right, it does look like it was a situation, there was a lot of conflict. 
a lot of disagreement, a lot of wars. That's coming to an absolute end. There's a new beginning. Because of this new beginning, this situation comes to an end, a new beginning that brings you fruitfulness and power and strength and abundance and, and um, expansion. So two aces. Have a look at that. Two aces. And you've got the gift of the heavens for you. You've got the winning award for you. You've got the sun. Everything is in your favor. Everything is going for you. It's going for you so that you can succeed and have exactly what you deserve. So the end of a chapter that was really, really harming you, like you were, you were overwhelmed. You were just feeling rejected, unhappy, tired, stressful. All that is gone. Destiny really is taking over and giving you freedom and abundance to be free, to have the abundance, to have the plenty of money, to have time out and really think about your next project, like to have the, the pleasure, the honor of being able to leave your job and look to the next level. It is it is quite rewarding to be able to do that. It, not everybody can do that. Not everybody can leave a situation. Uh, you know, each and every one of us are stuck in some way. So two new beginnings that are going to bring you abundance, wealth and money, unexpected coming, life-changing money, right after a journey. Oh my God, you're destined to live a life of luxury. Look at that. My dear Aquarius, look at that. Look at this, how this united again here. Showing a lot of money coming your way. Extraordinary money. Life-changing money. This is all happening um, from July onwards. After a journey that you're taking perhaps. Big money coming to you. Changing your life. And you're overcoming all your obstacles. Challenges. And becoming uh, victorious. It's a great victory for you here. I really feel like you are going to live a life of luxury. I do feel like there may be a windfall. This isn't normal to have... Um, a windfall and winning money both together and victory overcoming all your money obstacles and being filled with money. This is just extraordinary. And living a life of luxury and leisure, not needing to work. I feel like this gift is doing it. Winning money is another one. These are all for your support, supporting you because you've done so much. You've sacrificed over the years maybe, just working hard and doing for others. Doing for people around you, people that you love, maybe just working hard, and I feel like there's there's a big reward for you, my dear Aquarius, major reward. Wow. Okay. So what was ending was all that situation that was complicated, too much conflict. Let's have a look at the Knight of Wands. Let's see where you're going. What action are you taking? In regard to the Knight of Wands for all Aquarians. Okay, wow, there it is. So we're asking about the Knight of Wands, so we got it. You're taking action with someone of Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, to move to the next level. I feel like this person is going to help you, support you, help you move forward. You're destined, that's you, my dear um, Aquarius, you are destined to reach your goals and to see things clearly. So action is going to be in regard to you. You're moving, you're going with someone of earth energy. You're going together somewhere. You're traveling with someone or towards someone maybe, towards somebody. That's wonderful. Now, let's move on to the next level. And we have a look at... Okay, let's have a look at what's the death card all about. What is the transfer? Oh, no, this is actually, this is what you don't see coming. So we're not going to do that. We're going to find out what is the Knight of Pentacles all about? Because I do see an Earth energy here, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, very strong. Right, well, it does show that there is a situation that was very complicated. It's coming to an end. Maybe you were working for someone that was Earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and they were very harsh on you. There was conflict and you were not happy. So something is ending without a doubt. We've got the end of a chapter, beginning of a new one, a very victorious one that's starting. Something that had no more foundation and was just too much all of a sudden just falls apart and crashes so that's not bad at all uh whatever was no good it's gone now let's have a look at the devil maybe it was to do with the devil and codependency on a situation that you had no choice but you were codependent on and now finally it's over let's see the truth about the devil right it looks like a fire energy here is going to be very supportive someone with fire energy which is Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. This person is going to be very supportive to get you out of a situation perhaps where you were stuck. Maybe two people are helping and that's to do with this. You see the Eight of Wands, which is this card here, 
where there may be an offer, an offer that will be very hard for you to refuse. You need to take action quickly, and this is going to resolve problems and also support you in a great opportunity for you. So that's very important. I'll take this out. And it could be connected to this fire energy here. Could be connected to this person. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, supporting you to reach to the next level or an offer you can't refuse. An offer that takes you out of codependency and heal you from a situation where you were, you had no choices. So it's giving you more choices. Let's have a look at the Eight of Wands. Wow. It is about relocating. My goodness, my dear Aquarius, what is it that you're discovering? I feel like you're discovering some truth. And this truth is helping you make decisions about your path and where you're going to live and where you're going. This is the moon again. And it's showing here, like, yes, we had two, um, right? This is very important. You had two nights of uh, wand, which is taking action and moving and traveling. We've got two moons showing a lot of revelations and a lot of transparency, seeing the truth, clarity, to know where you're heading and where you're going and where you're going to end up and how you want to live. And you're relocating. You're thinking about relocation. You're thinking of relocating to another place, another city, another country, another place. You're certainly traveling. You're certainly changing. The truth is just, that's why we've got the, um, uh, the, uh, the tra transcending, the truth transcends you, takes you, out of not knowing where you stand and being in limbo. You're, you're making major decisions about your path and your life and your home and your destination, your, your, your foundation. You're making major decisions after revealing a lot of truth. This is big. This is the main thing in your reading. The revelations, the moon doubling up, taking action because of the truth that's been revealed to you. You think you're relocating. This is really major and this is really big. This is incredible. Wow. Yeah, and there is someone there, someone of Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I don't know whether they're supportive, or maybe this is a new person that's coming in your life. A rebirth is destined for you. Could be with someone of Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Healing, starting fresh, learning from the past, moving forward to the to the beginning, uh, to a new beginning, reinventing yourself, being compensated for all that you have gone through and endured. This is magic. Follow your bliss. That's all I can say. And the wheel of fortune is with, with you, justice is with you, and there is abundance of money coming to you, changing your life. My dear Aquarius, there's so much for you, so much bliss that you are going to follow and receive as a reward for all that you have done. Major transformations, changes in your life, in your money, work, career, and life overall. Let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the reading. Don't forget to support me by clicking on one or two ads and just letting them run. You don't have to see them. That's the greatest support you can do for me. And also, if you can watch the video all the way to the end without stopping it, that means a lot. Can't wait to hear your, your um, comments about this. Can't wait to hear what this is all about. Very interesting. And I look forward to doing your next reading very soon. Lots of love and light to all of you. Namaste.